Indocent Bank launches Salmon Rupay credit card. Indocent Bank has announced the launch of the UPI-enabled Indocent Bank Salmon Rupay credit card with NPCI, designed for government employees. Alchemy partners with Chimney for Digital Banking Solutions. U.S.-based Alchemy, a cloud-based digital banking solutions provider, has partnered with Chimney to provide digital banking solutions for financial institutions. The Government of Indonesia to launch nine super apps. The Government of Indonesia has announced its plan to launch nine super apps in order to optimize the manner in which individuals access public services. Boost and RHB Digital Bank Consortium start operations in Malaysia. Malaysia-based fintech Boost and its consortium partner RHB Banking Group have gotten approval from Bank Negara Malaysia, BNM, and the Ministry of Finance to operate as a digital bank. Intuit TurboTax included in Credit Karma and QuickBooks. US-based Intuit has announced the integration of its TurboTax service into Credit Karma and QuickBooks, for improved tax preparation and filling across its ecosystem. American Express partners with OVO Energy. UK-based Pay with Bank Transfer, powered by American Express has partnered with OVO Energy to allow the latter's customers to pay bills from their bank accounts. First Ontario Credit Union partners with Everlink and Flinks. Canada-based First Ontario has announced its partnership with Everlink and Flinks in order to provide its customers with open banking services. ePay policy launches BNPL for insurance. U.S.-based ePay policy has introduced Finance Connect to streamline premium financing options for insurance payments at checkout. Trade Republic launches new Visa card. Germany-based broker and savings platform Trade Republic has announced the launch of a new Visa card that combines spending and savings. TABBX launches Tabit. UK-based TABBX has announced the launch of Tabit, an app that intends to simplify and improve payment request sharing between friends and family in the region. A firm announces a partnership with Evolve. US-based payment network A firm has announced an exclusive collaboration with vacation rental hospitality company Evolve. Elo launches Elo Pay. Elo, a POS technology provider, has announced Elo Pay and the accompanying Elo Pay 7 integrated payment POS terminal designed for merchants of all sizes. Visa partners with CIBC and Simply Financial. Visa has partnered with Canada based CIBC and Simply Financial to add more digital wallets and enable the bank's clients to send funds across borders more conveniently. Rift secures £5 million British pounds grant from Innovate UK. UK-based Rift, a PSD2 compliant payments provider, has obtained a grant from Innovate UK under the Innovation Within Professional and Financial Services tender. Layer AI launches VPN for secure and rewarding online experiences. Blockchain network Layer AI has rolled Layer VPN its own virtual private network augmented by a reversal scheme, for a more secure and rewarding online experience. Bluefin upgrades Shield Conex. US-based payment and data security company Bluefin has announced that it upgraded its Shield Conex service with an additional capability. Socure achieves state RAMP authorization. Digital Identity Verification and Fraud Solutions provider Socure has announced it achieved state RAMP authorization, enabling state and local governments to verify digital identities accurately and securely. ItNow Solution approved for age verification by KJM. 
Germany-based ID now has announced its artificial intelligence-based solution IDCheck.io was approved by the German Commission for the Protection of Minors in the Media, KJM. Banco de Aspa to experiment with tokens in wholesale operations. Bank of Spain has collaborated with Cesabanca Banca Consortium to start experiments to use digital tokens in the settlement of wholesale operations. BitPay adds support for more cryptocurrencies. US-based provider of Bitcoin and cryptocurrency payment services BitPay has added support for 100 new cryptocurrencies. Alchemy Pay adds new bins for Hong Kong virtual crypto cards. Singapore based crypto payment gateway Alchemy Pay has added additional card bins for its Hong Kong crypto virtual card, expanding spending options. Trade Republic moves into payments after recording first profit. German neo broker Trade Republic has made its first net profit and is preparing to broaden its horizons with a move into card payments. PayPal names Barclays Vet Bladen UK CEO. PayPal has hired Barclays Managing Director of Customer and Digital, Simon Bladen, as its UK CEO. Opt to offer customers link monies pay by bank tech. Link Financial Technologies, Inc., DBA Link Money, a US-based open banking payment platform, and Opti, the world's first universal payments platform, today announced that they have established a partnership. B of A launches CashPro Insights. Bank of America has announced the launch of CashPro Insights, a digital tool that analyzes information flowing through the CashPro platform. American Express Bags First Utilities Client for A2A Bill Payments Pay with Bank Transfer, powered by American Express, has announced its first utilities sector partnership with energy company OVO, one of the UK's largest energy suppliers with 4 million customers. Namura backs new asset management tokenization platform Libre. Namura's Laser Digital and Fintech Hub The Web N Group are set to launch Libre, a tokenization platform for the asset management industry. Finborn and OpenFin join first cohort of IA's Engine Innovator program. The Investment Association, IA, has today launched its latest initiative through Engine, its specialist fintech accelerator and innovation hub for the investment management industry. DeFi startup Noah Ark bags $2.4 million investment. As a pioneer in the decentralized finance, DeFi, sector, Noah Ark Tech Group is excited to announce the receipt of a strategic $2.4 million investment from EOS Network Ventures, ENV. The rise of contactless payments. How businesses can adapt to the cashless trend. The prevalence of contactless payments is on the rise, driven by convenience. Business Payments Coalition launches DBN Alanis. The members of the US-based Business Payments Coalition, SE Invoice Exchange Market Pilot, have announced the establishment of the Digital Business Networks Alliance. Finverity partners with Tessellate Group for Capital Financing. UK-based Finverity, a digital trade and supply chain provider, has partnered with Tessellate Group, a provider of adaptable and scalable business systems. B of A launches a new data-driven treasury management tool. Bank of America has announced the launch of a new data-driven treasury management tool named CashPro Insights. Google Shopping Ads Available to Instacart Partners U.S.-based grocery tech company Instacart has announced the availability of Google Shopping Ads to its advertising partners, using its retail media data. BitGo receives in-principle approval to operate in Singapore.
U.S.-based crypto custodian BitGo has obtained in-principal approval for a major payment institution, MPI, license in Singapore. X plans P2P payments this year. Social media platform X, formerly known as Twitter, says it will introduce peer-to-peer -peer payments this year. Digital Business Networks Alliance launches to operate USC Invoicing Exchange Network. The participants from the Business Payments Coalition's e-invoice exchange market pilot today announced the establishment of the Digital Business Networks Alliance, DBN Alliance, a nonprofit organization that serves as the legal entity overseeing the exchange framework. Multi-fee contracts with Currency Cloud 2 for expanded SME payment service. Multi-fee, the UK-based cash flow management platform, has partnered with Currency Cloud, the experts simplifying business in a multi-currency world, to provide UK-based small and medium-sized businesses, SMBs, with an enhanced international payment solution, allowing them to seamlessly convert and send funds to their global suppliers worldwide in more than 35 currencies at highly competitive rates. Kuwait International Bank unveils KYC updates on mobile app. As part of the services offered through its mobile application, Kuwait International Bank, KIB, launched its Update Your KYC service that enables all customer segments to update their information and personal data wherever they are, whether inside Kuwait or while traveling abroad, at any time around the clock. BitGo receives in principle approval from Moss for major payment institution license. BitGo, the leading provider of financial services for digital assets, announces that its subsidiary in Singapore, BitGo Singapore Private Limited, has received in principle approval, IPA, from the Monetary Authority of Singapore, MAS, for a major payment institution license. This concludes our current edition of the Bay Pay Forum podcast. Remember that you can read the full text of each article in our news section on baypayforum.com. We hope to see you tomorrow.